I'm all about the good vibes. I know you're all about the good vibes. Do you know how much I love you? Wanna see you smile? Where's that happy girl that I know with a heart on fire? I'll do anything to make you fine, but I. Hi. I have to be quiet because I still have one kid asleep. The rest are at school. Abby can come home and see what I'm doing. I'm trying to get you to prop up here. Hi. I've got my little cake stands. I was going to do these um, birthday things in the morning. But Chelsea and Abby leave for school so early in the morning. that, And Jason left early this morning. That I just... I don't want to wake up Ashley in order to do Kaylee's. Well, I'd have to wake up Ashley and Kaylee. So we decided to not do this. But I do feel bad that, like, it's not their normal birthday way to, like, go to school without their birthday, like, being acknowledged, even though today is technically not their birthday. <laughs> but, so it just feels a little off. So I think I'm going to try and put these out, at least for Kaylee to see when she wakes up. She might be laying in bed awake. This one is hers. I only got four because they were $5 a pack. <laughs> and I don't need eight, but they didn't have any individual ones in the like the actual bakery section. And um, we don't need eight because we will eat them. And we don't need to because we also have these that we will need to eat. Look how cute these ones are. So yes, another Easter egg. But it is what Ashley chose. She knows that they're the Easter ones, but they're actually pretty appropriate for her because, I'm gonna show you. Because we know she likes ducks. She collects them for my car. Look how cute. It's a little, well it's not a duck, it is a chick. But she likes chicks. And then she likes sprinkles. So that one's really cute. And then I'm trying to figure out how to like put them on here really cute. So I'm gonna save the egg ones. These little nests. I'm not gonna put those ones out because those ones aren't as birthday-y. And I know this is technically like an egg, but it looks kind of cute and birthday-ish. So we're just gonna do those ones. What I might do is kind of stack plain ones. Maybe I'll stack plain ones underneath the cute ones. Let's see, I'll have one more plain one. Is that gonna work? Draw attention to the cute ones, I guess. Well, that's kind of fun. We will do that and then put a, a chicky. I'll put a chicky right in the middle. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? I don't know. Mmm, they're good. I'm going to tell the kids I don't know what happened to the 16th plain one. I don't, I don't know what happened to that one. It's gone. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to go make room for it on the table. That's kind of cute. Um, but show you what I got going on in here. I'm trying to decide, should I just do them on the floor or should I move the Bronco? <laughs> I don't know why the Bronco is like front and center. I'll probably move the Bronco. He is pretty cute though. Actually like having him sit on the, um, what do you call it? The record player is kind of cool. And yes, that's a Christmas present. I should have given this to Jason's brother when we saw him. And the Lego parts for it. We just haven't really like fully recouped in this room because <laughs> I just don't care. Um, okay, I'll put that back there. All right, so what I might go do, I mean, these flowers are kind of cute. Okay, so we can put the gifts up here. 
I'm kind of wanting to tease them a little bit. I don't know. I don't know if I should because this one is technically the striped one. It's not for either of them. It's not theirs. It's Chelsea's. I don't know why I'm whispering. <laughs> Kaylee's asleep. But um, Kaylee's big basket is upstairs. But I can't bring that one down because it's all open. Kaylee will see it during the day. So I can't bring that one down yet. So this looks a little anticlimactic. <laughs> I'm going to move, maybe what I'm going to do is move Ashley's up because her bags all kind of follow a theme and then make it look like these ones down here are just for Kaylee, even though they're not all for Kaylee. But it's still feeling not quite so festive in here. So I have to go to the dollar store to get tissue paper because this bag here, we don't have any in it, and you can see it, and you can see what's in that bag, and that bag, three bags, are missing tissue paper, which I need white paper anyway. So, um, okay, I can't put those donuts on. I'm gonna put you down. I'm gonna move Ashley's presents up, because ultimately when I can bring Kaylee's present down, hers is gonna go here on the floor. So that, that solves that problem. But when I go to the dollar store, to get some tissue paper, I'm gonna get balloons. I'm gonna get some balloons. Silvers, golds, maybe the blue color down there. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that. Maybe we'll go do that this morning. Um, but I gotta put you down and move the presents up and then find something healthier for breakfast. And then um, yesterday, I wanna tell you, because I don't really like talking about what I eat, but my friend, Jason went and worked out with her husband and came home with a loaf of her bread. So yesterday, super good by the way, so yesterday I made French toast with it with some strawberries, super good. So I'm kind of thinking maybe I'll finish off that loaf and make myself some French toast. I haven't tried to eat eggs again since I went off of my medication. I'm wondering if I still have an aversion to plain eggs, not like, um, I wonder if it was my injection medication that was making me not like eggs. I like them in French toast, but the texture, the smell, and the, like everything about regular eggs for months now, I haven't been wanting to do. I also haven't shown, um, this is like all over the place, sorry. I haven't shown all the other kids this gift, so I might like, I know it's in a box and Patty did a great job, <laughs> but I might go get, um, well, where did that bin go? I think Ashley took it for her, her own. You guys, I love, okay, I'm all over the place. This is just how I am right now because life is just weird. Um, Ashley took that little basket that Patty sent the gifts in. She wants to make it her own. She might turn it into a Sephora box. <laughs> but it's gotten worse in here for Ashley because she found diamond painting. I've had this kit sitting there, probably from one of you. I don't remember where that one came from. She just suddenly, in the middle of her absolute chaos, you can't even see the chaos. There it is. I was like, why would you want to sit here and do relaxing diamond painting in the middle of all that mess? And she's like, it doesn't bother me. So, anyway, I can't find that little bin that I got to put all this in, so I might pull a little bag. Um from the dollar store, like a little Easter bag. That'd be kind of cute. I'll get an Easter bag to put this kind of stuff in. And uh, maybe I'll save, well, Ashley's already seen it, so I can't really save it for anything else. I can't save it for Easter, because she's already seen it, so. and we, But we aren't eating it now. We're gonna save it and put it in our carry-on bags, which is gonna be hard, because you know Jason's gonna wanna eat the Twizzlers and the Moon Pies. <laughs> the mini moon pies, which are basically the same size as regular ones, apparently. Okay, I'm at the dollar store and I'm actually gonna remember to take in my bag. So I'll have to buy one. Let's see if we can get a few things here. All right, I'm gonna do a little dollar store haul here. We've got our balloons in the back, which I actually almost forgot um, when I was in the checkout lane. <laughs> Like, oh yeah, I came in for balloons. Luckily they had a whole bunch 
um, already blown up. Okay, I got a bunch of random things, and then I got a few extra things for birthday girls. Um, I found these little pouches. I've been looking for little pouches like this just to put in our carry-on bags. I'm going to use one. I'm going to see if Ashley wants one or Chelsea. They're just good for, like, little trinkets inside our bags so they don't get those little things, like electronics. Like, I think Chelsea needs a little bag like this to put, like, her charging cord, her headphones. I think Ashley needs one, too. So I maybe should have gotten three. But I got those two, and I know they're not the best colors, but uh, that was the best that I could find. Then I got a new um, sunglass case, just because mine is kind of worn out. This is what I have it in right now. Switch it. Sunglasses will go right down in there. Oh, and it matches my purse. I literally didn't do that on purpose. Look at that. It'll look cute with my purse. I just, I saw it, and I was like, oh, that would be a good thing to get. Then I got two razors. We have a bunch of razors at home, but I'm always looking for these like triple blade ones that have like the, can you see? They're just like wider right here. I know they're not name brand or anything, but the dollar store ones always work good for me. So, and I haven't seen that brand before, but anyway, pack one of those, see if the girls need one for their bathroom. And then I got these cute stickers. Obviously I'm not doing a birthday <laughs> uh, sticker page this year but I just thought it was cute because they're kind of like they're not necessarily 3d but can't really see there's like a third layer of paper I'll have to show you at home then I saw these cute little guys um, these little tide detergents we use tide all or all free and clear I think Kaylee will be fine not having the all free and clear with her laundry because hopefully she's outgrown all the little <laughs> allergies but this is a test to see if if she needs to get the all these are six loads worth so 12 loads I figure she's gonna do laundry she only does laundry at home like once a week and I only wash her and Abby's clothes and so I'm <laughs> betting she's gonna go like two weeks between you know like gathering enough laundry to like wash a load um, unless she needs to like wash her work clothes or whatever more often than that she doesn't have a job where she's going to college. This is for her birthday, by the way. But I figured this could last her like two or three months with only 12 loads. So why take a big, huge jug? And it's tied. So then I found some uh, makeup wipes to take on the plane with us and travel. I already have this kind right here. So I just got a kind of a fun one, the watermelon scented one, just to stick in our makeup bags. And I like to have one in our carry-on bag, especially with these long flights that we're gonna be on. We're gonna want to wash our face and just freshen up probably quite a few times throughout the, the ride. And I wish I had found more of these packages of the bacterial wipes. I have another Clorox one that I got the last time I was at Target getting like, you know, travel stuff, but I saw this one at, out of place and I didn't see any other ones, but they're just, you know, cleaning wipes for the plane. It's in a nice little container. I got some of those. I like to have those in a lot of different bags. Like Jason has one, I have one. We're not all sitting together. So, and then the last things I think I have are snacks for Ashley's birthday. I got her some Sour Patch Kids, some uh, Lollipop the Blow Pops, and then she loves these big bottles of like soda from here. I got Crush. Can you see that one in orange and grape? I tried to find the, um, I forget what the brand is. I, I like it too, but they didn't have any. It's, I can't remember what it is. Oh, dang it, I can't remember. I might look for that at Target when I take them to go get their airplane snacks. I don't know if we're gonna, if I don't go to book club tonight and they want to go get their airplane snacks, then we'll go do that after they open their birthday presents. Otherwise, we'll probably just go do that tomorrow night. I don't have any snacks for Kaylee's birthday. I always get them snacks. It's like, these are the things that I get and now they, they kind of, I don't like my kids expecting things, but it's a fun expectation to get a snack on your birthday. You know what I mean? Like, why not? It's the day you can expect something fun. I was gonna go to Target, but I think I'll wait and do that when we get airplane snacks with the kids. I have nothing else to do except for edit until the kids get home. Hmm, what shall I do with my day? I don't need to pack anymore. I could, I could go tinker. I haven't put any of the air tags into each individual suitcase, but when I do that, I need to label them so we know what suitcases may or may not go missing or where they are along the way. So maybe I'll go home and work on that kind of stuff. But I do need to go, oh, tissue paper, I have to go back in. 
dang it all i have to go back in the dollar store <laughs> tissue paper can i make it do can i make do i think i'm gonna make do i think i'm gonna pick um tissue paper from the other bags I really, it the line was so long and they were down to one register like halfway through me checking out okay i'm not going back in we're just gonna make we're gonna we're, pick from peter steal from peter what is the phrase Let's go get some of this ready. And look what I found. I forgot that I have like my little wrapping paper bin in there. So we're gonna found this in the car. I'm gonna put the little Easter treats in there from Patty so the kids can see them. Super cute. So I set that up for them to see when they get home. As soon as I kind of clean up the mess over here, I might scoot it down in front of that plant. That'd be kind of cute. And then I've got this stuff and the tissue paper. I'm gonna kind of come and add this to a bag and then I added the balloons up there so it's cute you know it is what it is certainly not what I normally do but I think the girls will still appreciate it all right the balloons have finally like stayed put up there that's actually really cute now I'm gonna bring down the other present for Kaylee and what I might do is fill the rest of it with tissue paper so she can't see what's inside it now that I have some more tissue paper let me show you what I'm talking about all right, ignore my unmade bed, but <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Look how cute. I'm so excited. She's going to be so excited. But I think just to kind of disguise it a little bit more, like I know she's going to know what's in here, but I don't want her to like come home before we open presents and have her see it. So, because it's really cute like this, I might just kind of tuck some paper t or some tissue paper like kind of down in little spots to kind of cover it up so it's really cute it's gonna look really good with the other bags and bows and stuff not bows but bags downstairs with this blue so that's so cute well it just looks like a big tub filled with tissue paper now but at least she won't be able to see what things are and then when she gets home i'm gonna have her take out the tissue paper and when i get a photo of her because it does look cute without the tissue paper but i just don't want her to see it leading up to opening so all right well i don't love the red bag i uh, was trying to trick kaylee when she came down here this morning to think that those three were hers <laughs> without telling her that I was bringing this one down. And Chelsea does need to open that one today, but I think it's all looking really cute. Come here, Paris. Paris, come here, sweetie. You gonna celebrate birthdays with us? Oh, I know you don't like me touching your head. Okay. Oh, goodness. Are you coming over to play for Kaylee's birthday? Yeah, where's Kaylee? She's right there. Happy birthday. First. One treat. Oh. Sit. Good girl. Oh, sit down. Sit. She's too excited. Put your boot for later. First. Sit. <laughs> Do you want it? There you go. There you go. What? Which side is which? Which side is which? Am I hmm. The top? I don't know. What do you think? I'm the top. You're the top? Because that bit is getting Yes. Yep. You're the top. And now you have to sit and wait three hours to wait for dad to come home. Actually, I have to wait for Abby to come home. She oh. <laughs> uh, Chelsea, you can have a fritter. Uh, did you see the little chickies? <laughs> the dogs always win. All right. I'm going to run really quick while the kids all play with. Uh, Paris and Jacob just got here. He's got Ashley a gift, which is cute of him. And he, as he says, he likes to play like the, what did he call it? Deadbeat uncle. And he leaves the gift in the Target bag. <laughs> so I don't know if he's already given it to her. <coughs> but um, he's going to hang out with us while we open presents later. Um, Jason's dad is going to come over. About an hour and a half. Jason is headed home from work, but he just said it was going to be about an hour for him to get home. And Abby doesn't get off for an hour and 20 minutes. So, and I guess it is. <coughs> Sorry, I had a frog in my throat. And Abby has a really busy day at work. There's some big hoopla thing going on. So she couldn't get out of it early. But 
I'm not terribly worried about going to book club tonight. I didn't read the book. I thought maybe I would get into it yesterday when I had some time in the car, but I just didn't. So, but Cafe Rio is Kaylee's all-time favorite meal out, and we're not going out to dinner at all for their birthdays before we leave. Um, we will obviously in Hawaii, and um, I just wanted to be able to like, get her her favorite meal before we go. I'm also getting Ashley a kid's meal <laughs> because that's her favorite meal. And that way I don't have to cook because Chelsea just had a sandwich after school and Jason has leftover teriyaki that he got her, himself and the computer tech person who fixed his computer today. It's probably about a thousand dollars for her, her to fix it for him. But he had a backup drive that he saved from, I don't know, a year or two ago, and it worked. Everything worked. And so he's very happy. He's on his way home. And uh, he doesn't need dinner either. So I'm off the hook from cooking. Perfect. Okay. Well, I got two of our salads. <laughs> and I had two gift cards still. So I saved $15. But the app wanted to update, but have not gotten my rewards yet. But they ran out of steak, and I was like, well, I'll wait. When, when can I come back, or how long is the wait? And he's like, like 30 minutes. And I was like, all right. He's like, you're okay with that? And I'm like, I'm not cooking tonight. <laughs> and they're short-staffed, so they got behind on making the meat, and then they're gonna be behind on prepping it and cutting it. But so I'm gonna run an errand really quick. I'll go get Ashley her dinner, and he'll just wait, because that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> That's totally fine. I, I mean, it would be appropriate that Kaylee got her salad and Jacob. It would have been sad if one of them got the salad and I got a salad, <laughs> you know. So it's fine, but I paid for it all. Just gonna go back in there as soon as I, uh, as soon as they're, I'm gonna give them some time. I, I literally have a half hour to wait, <laughs> but it's okay. I'm running out of luck today. Not only did I try and get water at uh, McDonald's when I got Ashley's, um, Happy Meal, did not order myself a Coke, just got the kids root beer and a root beer for Chelsea. <sighs> but my water is like a sparkling water. I don't know, it's like carbonated water, so it's disgusting. <laughs> I waited 40 minutes. It's been 40-ish minutes. Came back, they have the steak. Now they've run out of rice. Maybe you could have saved me some rice because I've already paid for it. Maybe when you realized you were down to one salad of rice left, knowing I'm coming back, you could have set aside that pan. So now I need to wait 20 minutes to <laughs> wait for my stupid rice. And if they run out of steak in 20 minutes, I'm gonna be so ticked off. I'm gonna be so ticked off. I just want my salad. And I can see Jason has made it home. I won't show you the address down below, but I just saw his um, door open. Let me see if he plugs his car in here. I got my salad. Praise be, they had rice and meat. Praise be. 